Now, someone sent in a question. I mean, this person is trying to put you on the spot. He, he, it's about Aziza Oshola. Now, he was asked, trying to compare the Aziza Oshola situation with uh, Ronaldo and Manchester United. Now, do you think Aziza Oshola not being in the team made the Super Falcons play better or play, you know, play well? Now, we Aziza Oshola got injured. You know, she's back to Spain to treat the injury, and coincidentally, the team won their next two games. So she, you know, this person trying to compare the Ronaldo. No, I'm not on this spot. It's not the Ronaldo. Trying to compare the Ronaldo situation. No. You know, when Ronaldo doesn't play, the team plays better and all that. So what would you, what do, what do you make uh, of that? Uh, it's, you a, think Oshola? it's a different, it's a different scenario. You know why? Asisa Oshola was put in a team that is programmed to fail, right? So it's not the Ronaldo situation. Asisa Oshola, I refuse to dance to that tune. Asisa Oshola is not a bad influence to the Super Falcons. She's not a negative you know, she came out. She came out to release a statement that yeah, she's seen all the comments. She even said even the negative ones <laughs> that she saw it. Thank you. You know, I know that. You know, definitely there were some negative comments. You know, a lot of people could, you know, come out to say, still the majority were talking about, you know, come out to say that she doesn't put enough effort in the national team. When it comes to the national team, she doesn't play with that. You know, even her absence, good redance, you know, stuff like that and all that. So, you know that was the, the angle this person is trying I, to come from. I, I, so, do I you understand. think it affects the team? I understand. It makes them play better. I understand this kind of comment. When I got fired in Brilla, the <laughs> first <laughs> first trailer load of comment was good readers to bad rubbish, stupid analysts, not good enough. Those same people are still lamenting to do. You understand? See, people, social media people are impulse people. They don't. Most people don't think before they see the things that they see, and then because of our egotistic nature and pride. When we say the things we say, instead of realizing that, oh, I made a mistake, I shouldn't have said that, and humbly, or just apologize and move on, the, you now start defending it. You now start, that's what messing up this country. You now start justifying it and defending it. The team, re, listen, the team was set up in such a way that it was not good for anybody to play football. Right? Strikers feed off good passes from their team. There is no chemistry between uh assisat and onumunu in the first place even onumunu was way off because she was playing in the wrong position all the channels that she was supposed to run into was the channel that assisat was running into because they are two boot strikers right then the one chance that she got the goalkeeper saved you can't you can't kill her for that having said that she also didn't have the midfield that was backing her assisat is not used she's played for arsenal ladies liverpool, liverpool ladies yeah. she went to china she played for barcelona she played for fc robo all the teams that she's played for they pass the ball to leg you come in and just introduce a system where you play route one you think it's going to work overnight you think players are not robots even robot needs reprogramming she cannot just become uh, a route one player from knock the ball into space find the the the, 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 the spaces be behind the lines of the opposition put the ball there and, and meet it and then all of a sudden you don't do that you play one long ball that gives advantage to the defense every time you play a long ball remember the attacker is running forward towards the goal with the ball behind him. The opposition defender have only one job. I'm yeah. seeing the ball. Let me stop the ball. Who gets the advantage? In football, it's the defender that gets the advantage. That's why the big teams in Premier League or in European football always beat the smaller team. You know why? The smaller teams struggle to play the ball from the back. Every time you meet a small team like the West Ham, that's why West Ham give people problems. The West Ham who play the ball from the back, the big so-called big team begins to struggle. They may not have quality like them, but once you are brave enough, to play the ball, to knock the ball from back. Igbo people will say knock unkwa. If you are able to knock the unkwa from back to front, the big so-called big team gets stranded. So this game was played with the Super Eagles set up to give advantage to South Africa. You cannot blame Assisat for that. Like I said before in my analysis of that defeat, I said, play this game another day, make the right selection. We will beat South Africa. I mean, as bad as the day we were, it ended 2 1. So I don't think as he said, let's not be too quick because this attitude is how we destroy the Super Eagles. Mm -hmm. We should learn from it and not repeat it with the Falcons. This same attitude of killing anybody who have celebrated victory with the Super Falcons have goals that as he said, scored. So at what point did she become a bad girl? At what point did she become a bad, a negative influence? Are we allergic to successful people? Because this whole Strong of hate towards Assisat started from her success. So. Started from her success. All these gift money that we're calling her, the day they become successful, we will see hate them. The same thing we did with the Okochas of this world, the Ulysses of this world, the Amokashes of this world. We just thought, Amokashi became a bad boy when he started showing private jets. 
Taribo West, who would die for Nigeria, bleed for Nigeria, became a bad boy when we when they said that he lives in a building in Milan that aeroplane can rotate in. Let's not forget our history so fast. That's who we are. We should stop it. This girl played in a team that did not support his perform uh, performance. Sorry, a performance because they didn't play to her strength. And any player that plays in a team that doesn't play to their strength, there's a problem. When Fernando Torres was playing for Liverpool, the coach deliberately I, I saw a coach's voice video that um, uh, rafa benitez did he said they deliberately put F uh, uh, steven gerard right behind him yeah to give him you seen that, yeah, that video? and you know the funny a couple of years ago I, I explained that story but people didn't get it when fernando torres went to chelsea he didn't have that to create a counter for because that's the system he's been playing in Spain everywhere he's gone. So to have that was not a problem. And then you now add the pressure of him missing. How did Fernando Torres, El Nuno, the guy who scored goals for living, go to Chelsea and couldn't score a single goal? Was it because he was arrogant? Why is it that Nigeria, once a player doesn't have a good game, it's because they are proud, it's because they're not putting their body. Is it that uh, Fernando Torres was not putting his body in, in, in Chelsea? He collected 50 million tra tra transfer fee for Liverpool and then collected those big salary, 250, I mean 225,000 every week and then he, he refused to put his body is that is that really true but sometimes when we say this thing in nigeria we should think and say okay but we followed this road before it's not the right road to follow let's change i don't think it is because she left what happened was that asis atoshuala left and all of a sudden the coach realized that my job is on the line i'm going to lose if i play like this and yeah. he changed the playing system and that playing system worked yeah. to the strength of the team that's why they won both games asis atoshuala was if asis atoshuala was in that team and they played this system they would still have won hello my name is sumera i am from pakistan and you are watching elegbeta tv radio please subscribe thank you hi my name is abdullah ali i'm from pakistan the number one country in the world in cricket you're watching Leg Better Sports TV Radio. Please subscribe. You know, like, like I said, this person was trying to put you on the spot, but uh, you know, rightly said, and you you try to you know clear that up. I don't think I don't think you know. It, like I said, it's just a mere coincidence. She got injured, traveled back, and the team started winning. So it has nothing to do with her being in the team that they lost the first game, and you know she's not there. They won the next Again, game. Again, how does this happen in football? How so does your national team player get injured? And instead of sending good wee messages, get well soon, we hope that you recover fast, and all that. No, nah, there were a lot of... You all know, you do is bashing her. Bash and tomorrow, no if you invite her, <laughs> and she doesn't come, you say she's unpatriotic, she's not nice. You think these things don't get to them, right? You, they, these people think that these things don't get to them. Despite the fact that these players come out to say they don't pay attention to all those things, they do. Everybody they pay do. attention they, you know, they to come it. Out they, don't, they don't focus on all those things. Uh, you, you could tell I they beg. do and they focus I, on all I, those I, things. I beg. <laughs> until, until you meet them one-on-one. -on -one. All right. You know, have, you, have, you not met, have you not met Osime one-on-one -on -one and he tells you everybody, a list of everybody who's been talking trash about him, both in the, in the media or any other players? Everybody do. Me, I do. This is, you can't say that. We do. And it's wrong. See, yeah, sometimes when you do wrong, you bash people. It's, it's okay. But <laughs> I don't see where you bash somebody for something that they've not done wrong. How do you even justify they are not putting their body in the game? Like, did you give them a pass and they didn't score. How many chances did we create in that game? Compared to the other two games, we create better chances because the team was set up properly. People should also look at that. And again, this is why I always tell you, that if you want to grow in this job, don't listen to the majority. They will hate me for saying it, but I mean, they've been hating me all my life. So what's the big deal? Who cares about their love? You are listening to a Legbete TV radio.